$25 million budget shortfall, and some of the proposed cuts have some people shaking their heads. But as Anjanette Levy tells us, nothing's official yet. Amari Canyon and his dad are regulars at the Over the Rhine Rec Center. And this is what we do every day, library, and then we come here. So hearing that the head of the Recreation Department recommended closing it to save money, along with rec centers in Westwood and Hartwell, was disheartening to say the least. These things are vital, I think, to the community, and I would think that would be a, a shame if they closed them down. The proposed cuts include closing four swimming pools, Camp Washington, Spring Grove Village, Mount Adams, and Filson, and closing the Braxton Can Clinic in Madisonville is listed by the Health Department as a way the city could potentially save money. These proposed budget cuts came from city department heads. That doesn't mean that they'll actually end up in the city manager's budget. What we ultimately end up doing will most likely not resemble most of what's been presented. City manager Harry Black says with a $25 million budget deficit, this will be the most challenging budget the city has put together in years. He's promising no layoffs, and he says service will not be impacted, especially when it comes to public safety. Black says he will challenge department heads to find other solutions. I am hopeful that my department heads are maximizing and optimizing creativity as they go through this exercise. Uh, but to say that you're going to close a health clinic, that's too easy. We're not going to do that. For the sake of the children in the neighborhood, William Canyon hopes the doors of the city's rec centers will stay open. And a lot of these kids, I mean, you look outside these windows and I mean, what do they have to look forward to? So they come here, it's more like a sanctuary to them. And Jeanette Levy, Local 12 News. The city manager will give his proposed budget to the mayor in May. Well, you have probably